<laughs> Look at my chunky fat boy. He's just so fat! Everyone say hello to Agumon X. Black? Actually, it's hard to tell what order it is. Okay, yeah, see, in my defense, that said Agu just says Agumon X. It's kind of cool. And their eyes. Their eyes, though. They're a little frightening. Staring. Straight into my soul. Yeah, when he's happy, that's good. So it's like, you know, just keep him happy. Or, yeah. Oh, or angry, apparently. Angry's not so bad. Hold on. Yeah, see? Oh, that's good. I love it. That's like one of my favorite aesthetics when like something spooky or feisty does the teeth where the top goes all the way down. It's like the Gengar teeth. That is a good aesthetic. So get a look at their face because they've got a nice, they got a nice thing going on here. Back to the viruses, I suppose. So that's going to be easier to get a hold of. And what? What? Who took Agumon X Black to the glamour shots? That was, hold on. That looks too good. Glow up much? Because this is like the opposite of what I was accusing Okuomon X of. You know, where they're like, in person, you look better than the picture, but that- Wow! That's like the episode of Spongebob where Squidward gets his face knocked in so much he becomes handsome. Well, really, the thing to be done with them at this point is to just give them good care and give them full effort. I want to- wait, really? One of your efforts just went down? But I just played with you and did, like, super perfect things. You just want to show everyone your face again, don't you? Okay, go on. Oh my god. As I was saying, what I want to do with them is to give them good care and good effort. They'll be going down the basically Agumon line except black until at the very end, there is no Omegamon X in this device. So from there, we have a few different choices, um, and I don't want the obvious one. I don't. By obvious, I mean the one where you just do the best care. I don't want that one at the very end. We are merely a few days away from Digimon Adventure Last Evolution Kizuna from releasing the next big movie, and probably not the last, featuring season one, of adventures protagonists. And have you heard of this little pop-up shop in Kichijoji's Parko? By the way, Parko is a is like a, a chain of big old department stores. It's only open until like March 1st. Go in there, look at the pillows. Look at the shirts with the little Digitama patterns on them. Go buy them and then maybe send me one. You know, just a thought, an incidental thought I just had maybe because uh, Kichijoji Japan is kind of far away from me. Um, and I also don't know if I can get there in time. There's only, a, as of this video, uh, gosh, I don't know, maybe 14, 13, 14 days left before March 1st comes around. Even if I take a reed and then put it in my mouth and then stick the other side of the reed outside of a box and then ship myself, like, ground mail to Japan, to Kichijoji, I'm not sure I'd get there in time. So look, I'm, I've, all my options are exhausted. I need the shirt with the Digi Egg. And if any of those products look familiar to you, it's because it looks like a lot of the products are comprised of overstock from previous pop-up stores. But if you see anything unique, let me know. I segued into that after the talk of the movie because it seems like the pop-up is related to people getting hyped up about that kind of thing. People are going to go watch this movie, they're going to get nostalgic, and then they're going to go buy themselves a shirt with a little Digitama Egg pocket. It's genius. Bandai's on point lately. Just out of curiosity, because I know you're a traded egg and you're only level 3, but that's not your max, is it? We don't have any level requirements for Agumon, not at, you know, not at these rookie stages, but what could you do, you know? Like, what are you capable of? Maybe not capable of much, because I was considering going through the Numamon X area after giving them an XP booster and just seeing if they could handle that, because look, this, this is an item that I did not see in the version 1 of the DMX, but there's just totally an experience booster. And what it seems like is you take this and it just doubles the experience you get. So it's like... Here. I guess we have three, so... I guess use it or lose it, I suppose? Here. I know this is stupid. I know this is very dumb, but if we can even win one of these, they're gonna level up, okay? I haven't encountered any Numamon Xs. We haven't done any events for that yet, so... Yeah, no, I can hear you, you guys. You're like, what are you doing to them? Stop it, they're just a baby! And I agree, but also, we could get big wins? You know? Don't blame me for playing the slot machine. Blame Bandai. Blame them for giving me the slot machine. Okay. We're gonna watch this happen. Yeah, see, look. Numamon X is gonna crumble under how handsome we are. <gasps> What'd I say? Crumble. Absolutely. Yes. Nice dodge. Just make one hit and you're good to go and you get double experience. That's gonna be 440. Hey! Come on. Yeah, see? I think the boys got it. They've gone from lots of care mistakes up to just absolute perfect care. I always say this ends up creating some of the most spoiled, obviously also, emotionally stunted children, but god darn it, he's just so Squidward handsome. All right, round two, the experience booster is applying to this entire uh, little challenge. So as long as we can get through it, yes, very good. As long as we can just keep going, we're gonna keep getting that double experience. Yes, good. Dodge it. 
I, I can't imagine that anything would hit Agumon X Black because their eyes are always so open. Like, y they don't blink, I don't think. At least not very often. And if they do, it's not very apparent. Here we go. <laughs> oh my gosh. It's kind of sad because I had a... I'm pretty sure old Kuomon X was having trouble with these Numamon Xs before. And now it's not even a thing for Agumon X Black. But the final one... The final Numamon X, I don't know. I'm pretty sure we get the same amount of experience, so I can only just assume that it's, I don't know, the same difficulty, but you never know. With these devices, sometimes you just run out of luck. This has to hit, because, oh yeah, see, that's the problem. If we miss that first big hit, that's when things get a little more unclear. Oh, but look at that. Numamon X isn't exactly hitting all the marks today either. Yeah, go, go to, yeah, just be, be subtle. I mean, honestly, all you need is just, just two of those, and, <gasps> no! If that hits, we're dead. Yes! Very nice! Come on, just just do like a good, yeah, just another nice solid hit. Ah! Well, on the plus side, that Joker can't do any more giant poops. Just a couple of small ones. Uh-oh. This could be anyone's game at this point. <gasps> the face again? Really? Really? Well done! I'm so proud of you! First you were like, just kind of emo? And now you're handsome and you're winning? And also, you just replaced that experience booster that you just used. Wow. That was cool. That's not something you see every day, okay? I know they're just Numamon Xs, but they're also still pretty strong, okay? That's all for me today. I hope you all have a good weekend, and I won't see you tomorrow because, I, like I said, I, I don't really do videos uh, on Mondays. But I will see you Tuesday for the stream stuff where I'm going to open this box of nanoblock things where I'm going to see if maybe there's a bunch of spiders inside. Could be fun! Thanks, patrons, for supporting this channel, especially Nobro Shifter and Dog Trainer 89. I'll see y'all next time. Have a good one!